Hello everyone, I am Ghulam Abbas. I hope you guys are fine and doing great. In this video, I am going to show you how you can uh, create, uh, configure and restore a system restore in Windows 11. So to put it simple, this setting is available from back Windows 7 and up till now it is going on. So if I have to open this post, it is written inside the howtogig.com. They have written a very clear and a very good article regarding to the system restore in Windows 11. Now system restore is basically a snapshot of the operating system. Uh, whenever you have, to, uh, sorry, if you have installed a software on the computer, it has a very bad impact, bad impact on the PC. Then uh, in other words, you cannot boot your computer. So this is a very bad thing. In order to fix it, you, can, you have just simply to use system restore and then it's going to restore to the point where windows was working uh, very clearly and that software is not installed on the pc so uh, basically i have to tell you that everything that i am uh, recording this video is taken from this article inside the howtogeek.com i'll provide the download link in, sorry the link in the description you can come here and visit it if you want to so to access the uh, uh, restore point there are basically multiple ways you can access the very first thing is that you have to simply search for create a restore point uh, search for it in the sort menu and then open it uh, this is the very first thing is and the second thing is uh, you can also access it using the using this sysdm.cpl and then click ok now you are in the system properties and then from there you have to go to the system uh, protection you can also access uh, it from the about section of the uh, yeah, from the about, uh, about section of the uh, Windows settings, just click system uh, protection and now you are here. Although you can see that there is not a dark theme available on it, but I hope Microsoft should bring a dark theme in the system properties too. So, by default, you can see that the uh, system protection is turned on on the drive C, which is the system. If you want, if it is not turned on, you can just simply click configure and then you have to simply choose this option, turn on system protection. Now by default, when you turn it on, uh, it will choose the amount of storage by itself. So it is not really needed for you to choose the option. But again, if you want to configure some other storage, additional storage, uh, it will uh, use also. And besides, you can see that it is written that you can adjust the maximum disk space used for system protection as space files up. All the restore points will be deleted to make room for the new ones. So there is not a very a lot of storage, only 7.26 GB. This is an SSD uh, of 500 GB. So if you want to delete a, a restore point, just simply click delete restore point and then it is going to delete the restore points available at the moment so it is not turned on if it is not turned on just simply click configure now to create a new restore point just simply click create and then name it how about windows 11 uh, just installed yep just here's just a name just and then simply click create and now it's going to take a while and it will create a system restore protection uh, on the uh, windows 11 yep that is created now how about this thing uh, if you see that if you have installed the uh, this software which basically is not very good uh, so your system is not working then you have to restore the computer so just simply click system restore and you can see that uh, by default uh, it is saying that recommended uh, restore select this option to undo the most recent update driver or a software installation if you think is causing the issue so uh, you can see that uh, click on the scan uh, what was that name scan programs that was installed during that time and if you use this restore point the recent restore point you can see that these surfaces will be removed so we have to hold on until uh, it has to check that affected programs and drivers using that software so we'll have to wait a moment okay here now you can see that uh if you restore these uh programs will be basically removed programs windows update and the drivers so these are a lot definitely very a lot so if you think that this is not a very good restore point you can just simply click choose a different restore point and then you can see that 
uh, here are three restore points taken in the windows 11 so you can see that uh, this restore point is taken a moment ago uh, 12 4 here is now 12 11 that's 12 4 and this is taken 12 9 so uh, three minutes ago you can just simply click and then uh, click next and then click finish it's going to restart and after restart it will take some time and then everything will be restored to the normal so this is basically how you can uh, create a restore point in windows 11 so till next time have a nice day and goodbye